2017 Oscars have come and gone, and I want to talk about one thing in particular. Not the Ron Parson being pop on the in memorandum, not the wrong best picture coming out, because those are just still accidents. Things happen, no one's perfect. PWC are massively apologizing for those. I want to discuss the fallout from Suicide Squad winning a best picture. Woo. <laughs> First of all, let's have a little look at how the Marvel fanboys are reacting. <laughs> Okay, that was me being a little bit silly there, but there is a lot of hate online for this. If you just check out Twitter, people are freaking out. Let's have a quick look at two of my favorite looks. Uh, Lou Fertel just tried saying the Oscar winning Suicide Squad out loud, and he instantly developed asthma, hives, and horns. Hashtag Oscars. Okay, um, I'm pretty sure he's just having a bit of fun with it, so I can see why I'm not too upset about that one. One I will pick apart is Samantha Cohen's I Can't Believe in Suicide Squad won an Oscar for writing damage on Jared Lowe's forehead. It was a bit more than that. Like, I guess I'm being a bit of a contrarian here coming to defense of something everyone's insulting, but let's face it, Killer Croc looked totally badass. And, you know, they made Harley Quinn look realistic. And Okay, yes, they wrote damage on Jared Lowe's forehead. I won't let that one go. <laughs> but it's... uh. I think people are taking this a little bit too seriously. There wasn't exactly a huge competition for makeup this year. And let's face it, Pearl Harbor also has an Oscar and it gets ripped apart a lot. But you know, some people are celebrating. Uh, we've got, you know, footage of the DC fanboys. So check this out. <laughs> This was just a bit of fun. Congratulations to the Super Sky Squad guys. It was a fun film, and maybe it wasn't exactly an Oscar contender, but you know what? You won, and the makeup looked great. So hats off to you guys. Have a good one, and I'll see you all soon.